Hi, this is Chris Walker with Big Angie Fan Channel. Here with another in my A to Z series of reactions and reviews based on Rocky Sh Rusty Shackelford's 132 song compilation. I reached the E's now, and this is every time we say goodbye. Now there is one of her definite masterpiece versions of this, which is a TV uh, TV um, performance, just with one guitarist. But I'm going to go with this uh, different one from 2019 from some concerts that Boris Palinovsky uh, recorded, and he recently released some enhanced versions of those recordings. So, from what I heard before, you know, most of her performances here are really good. The band is not as good, but as she has, she's had better bands with some of her other performances, but she's really in fine voice here. Let's, uh, and I want to hear how it sounds different from the TV one. This is how we have to every time we say goodbye. Fra and Ella Fitzgerald. Every time we say goodbye, I die. Yes, you can see how her uh, her phrasing has evolved. The, uh, the TV special is just very, very creamy and beautiful tone all the way through. This one is more jazz, more variation in the phrasing. And uh, yes, this whole concert, she was just masterful jazz vocals. And so if you think you've seen all of her songs, you know, make sure you've seen all the versions of her songs. This whole, this concert, just every, about every version that I've heard has been a really good version. When you're near, there's such an air, about it. I can hear like somewhere. Like the phrasing of that line was quite a lot different from the uh, TV special. It also definitely seems a bit faster than a TV version. I'm wondering if she wanted it that way or as a case that she has had with other bands that you know their their timing is not as she would like it. Um, but you do get the feeling it's slightly rushed. But um, that's one reason I don't feel bad about talking over it because this band isn't as good as some other bands. Breathiness there. Like 
He stretched out that last phrase every time we say goodbye. Just uh, what a jazz master. This is, of course, at age 13. Check out Billie Jean if you want to see some ridiculously good jazz singing. So, uh, yeah, always check out alternate versions. You know, some of the alternate versions are, you know, not so good. But a lot of them are you know, as good or better in some ways than the ones you're more used to seeing. And this is a good example of that. That is just uh, you know, even more refined jazz singing than in the first one. I'd still give the, the masterpiece label to the first one just because of the production quality. It seemed a little bit less rushed. And, um, <clears throat> you know, I let her voice shine more with, with just the, the one guitarist. But um, this one is very, very good also. So this has been Chris Walker with Big Angie Fan Channel here in beautiful Hawaii. Aloha.